hello hello so i'm getting ready to make some really delicious vegan fried mushroom veggie burger it tastes just like if it was like it has like a consistency of meat this is oyster mushrooms so good so first i'm going to use chickpea flour as the batter so I'm gonna use a little bit of dill. Using a little bit of turmeric. A little bit of ginger. Just a dash. Some salt. Oregano. Oregano. And my basil. I don't have any more, I don't think. I'll use a little bit of sage. I ran out of basil. And now I'm just going to add some water and keep stirring it until I get like a pancake consistency. Y'all got to taste this. Let me tell you something. I went to the beach and they had a vegan spot and I was obsessed with their burger. It was like a, it's a chicken burger. It's pretty much they use the oyster mushroom, but um they did it on a waffle right i'm just gonna make my own bread out of probably cassava flour and coconut flour or arrowroot i'll figure it here soon i don't have the waffle maker so but i said i told my husband i said i'm going to mock this because this is a good and I sure did the other day and boy when I tell you I was dancing it seemed like for hours I was so excited it was so good okay so I think like a consistency like this is good a little bit thick not too runny it can stick to the mushroom now I'm just gonna take out the vegetables that I'm going to use let's see I might just put these in here too because I'll give some to my youngest son. Maybe a little bit to both the boys. And I'm just gonna have some onions and I'm gonna use the rest of the cilantro. I'm just gonna, okay, I'm gonna take it like this, like that. And zip it like that. Or I'm gonna use a little bit of coconut flour. I actually gotta get more. Use it with some arrowroot powder. And I know I am not giving the exact measurements, but uh, I'm not that great at that. I do everything by vision just enough to make two buns so if you could <laughs> figure how much it is probably maybe like a cup a half a cup of the coconut flour and a half a cup of the arrowroot and then I just add a dash of um cassava flour <laughs> you're lucky I'm not on live <laughs> <laughs> Be back uh, Thursday, I think. When? Probably Thursday. I'm not gonna make it 
Ooh, you saw that? I'm not gonna make it too thick nor too thin. Just a decent consistency to make two patties. them over. Grab a handful at a time. And I just make the shape of a bun. Now this doesn't, sometimes I get it perfect to where it holds up and sometimes it doesn't hold up. Now I'm just gonna put these in there instead <laughs> the tomato. I gotta I don't eat my tomatoes um raw. This is the bread. Okay, so now I'm going to build the burger. So this is supposed to be like chicken tenders. So I'm gonna add some avocado to it. Alright. Then I add my onions, cilantro, tomato. And you don't have to put tomato if you don't like it. You don't have to put onions if you don't like it. I don't eat tomatoes. I haven't eaten tomatoes for over a year. So I don't eat it too much, but kind of wanted to have some. So I'm having some. The rest of these I'm gonna eat separately. And then I add some coconut aminos. Y'all, it is so good, I promise. Promise, so good. Taste it. Let me know what you think if you do try it out. That's how it looks. So let me know what you think about it, and I'll talk to you soon. Remember to find happiness in all you do. God bless.